what's up everybody welcome back uh today i'm gonna be reviewing this wild game innovations 270d uh game feeder and um just gonna show you a little bit about it the specs and details and all that so here we go all right guys here's the feeder and as you can see it's already thrown out corn a lot of it we have corn all the way over here all the way almost over to that little tree right back there but this thing will sling corn and that's not a joke either it goes far um so a little bit about this thing it's got up to four feed times turn it on here as you can see it's 10 21 a.m and that's all right so we're gonna hit that button go up feed time one is set on 12 p.m feed time two is set on 6 a.m and actually I'm gonna change the duration of the feed time to five seconds. And we're gonna move up to feed time three, that's 12 a.m. Got it set on 20 second duration. And then here's a 6 p.m. feed time gonna drop it down to five seconds also but let's test it all right so it's testing now we got a five second timer well ten seconds but now it's at five and boom That's pretty cool. Corn, as you can see, was being thrown all the way back there. And this thing works pretty good. Actually, really good. It's only about uh only about a hundred bucks on Amazon after shipping and everything, but it can hold up to 270 pounds of feed. And when I got this feeder, there, I had no problems with it really, except for this. These, some of these tabs are kind of, you know, destroyed, uh, or not there. But, uh, this wasn't a big deal for me because I, I mean, it's just extra support. It's not gonna fall over or something because, or break because it doesn't have those tabs or at least all of them. But this thing has three more legs also. I don't know, I don't have all the legs put on it, but this thing's like, I'm like 5'8", so this thing is like seven foot five, seven foot eight to the top. And let's see if I can get you guys down in here. You can see I got corn in there already a lot two bags and it's not even over halfway yet but yeah this is a very inexpensive feeder for the quality of it and this has only been the third day out i believe the third day that i've had it set up and you can see the corn's coming out good no problems None of it's fallen down onto this little tray right here. So the, not tray, but onto the, uh, this little bracket and the digital timer. So I don't think I'll have a problem keeping the squirrels off of this. And from chewing it up, 
I don't think, but if we have that problem, then I guess I'm gonna have to start squirrel hunting too, so. But yeah, this is the Wild Game Innovations 270D game feeder. And you can really use it to about feed just about anything. I guess if you wanted to put it on the end of a dock and put fish food in it, I guess you could feed your fish, I don't know. But yeah, this is, it's a really nice feeder, guys. So uh, for a hundred bucks, I think it's worth it. I'll give it five stars all day long. And we'll see how it keeps doing after a couple weeks and as the next few months move on. And if I have anything come up, any problems with the feeder, I'll let you guys know. Thanks for watching.